Offline Dataset Publishing is a powerful survey CTO capability that allows you to design flexible data collection workflows that work at all times, whether you're connected to the internet or not. Without Dataset Publishing that works locally, data captured in forms must travel to the server and be downloaded by the devices that require it. With Offline Dataset Publishing, data required on the device that collected it is available immediately on the Survey CTO Collect app for preloading into forms. To illustrate, let's look at the example of an evaluation of an assistance program for farmers engaged in forestry. In this program, it is expected that farmers will be able to grow a certain number of trees that meet predetermined criteria. Evaluators visit farms at several points over the program's duration to measure the trees and assess those which are underperforming. To demonstrate, here is the Survey CTO Collect app. Note from the Send Receive status menu that we're currently offline. There is no connection to the internet. Our evaluator has arrived at the first farm. She opens the measurement form from the full blank form menu. Then she identifies the farm in the form and then captures measurements for the first tree. She'll open the same form again and fill it out for each of the trees. Notice the pre-populated name of the farm from the first time that the form is filled out. A server dataset stores the name locally, which gets preloaded back into the form. The evaluator will continue measuring all the trees. The form is also able to display progress toward the total number of trees on the farm, also thanks to dataset publishing working offline. See the count next to Send Finalized Form. These are all forms that haven't yet been sent to the server and are published locally, which helps track progress inside the form, also feeding data into the follow-up form. Once the assessor has finished measuring trees, she will open the follow-up form in case some of the trees need more information captured about them. In this form, the assessor picks the farm from the list, which is also available thanks to offline publishing. The list of trees that were captured are preloaded offline and assessed in the background, checking if any are smaller than one standard deviation from the mean. In the design, because some of the trees were flagged as undersized, a few follow-up questions are necessary just for the flagged trees. This and many other much more advanced and flexible data collection workflows are possible, especially in combination with Survey CTO's other features. Thanks for watching.